So last fall, I had this crazy idea of building a floating boathouse. On paper, it sounded really good, but it was a pretty bad idea. Now, I won't go into the reasons why it wasn't a good idea, but basically my mom didn't want me building it and I really didn't need it. So with that said, you're gonna see what this project turns into, how far I get with it, and it's pretty cool. So I hope you guys enjoy watching the video and uh, stay tuned. Out of these hoses, pretty tight. Hopefully they stay home, don't rip off. I mean, they're pretty malleable. I'm afraid they might slip off, but oh well. At least the weight will hold it down. All right, so we're now building part two of the uh, crane boat. Just got the frame put out. We're gonna put in the barrels. Missing the caps for those barrels. We're gonna get some soon. The other sections are ready to go. So wish me luck. All right, got the frame all done. It's fairly sturdy. I'm now gonna flip this over so I could add my uh, boards to hold barrels in on the top. Kind of like deck boards to hold it in, but uh, yeah, let's flip it. Alrighty, so we got all our barrels strapped in. We're just missing a few caps. Once we get those ready for the launch, we launch two bad boys, connect them. We're gonna have a crane. <laughs> so at this point of the build, I decided that I still wanted to go ahead and build a crane with the existing structure of the boathouse. So I would still make the shape and the initial structure of the boathouse, but just slap a crane on top instead of a boathouse. And then maybe end up putting a boathouse on it eventually. What you're looking at right now is a 50 foot long boat. That's right, with both the boathouse and the main barge, we're looking at a total of 50 feet in length. That's huge, that's way too big. And as you can see, I don't have much shoreline left 
for all my other boats and my dock. So instead of making a big boathouse, I decided to split it into two mini boats. So I take one side of the pontoons and turn it into a mini crane, and the other side I would turn into some sort of shack, which ends up being a mini pontoon or mini barge in the end. So yeah, let's get back onto the project. So, what did I learn from this project? Well, basically, there's two things. Number one, don't build things without your mom's permission. And number two would be that basically, you know, some of our desires aren't necessarily what we want and really need. So, sometimes it's better just to do what is actually, you know, what, what you want and what you need. So, I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video.